That's me! God damn it! Hey guys, it's Tazzle here. What was Tazzle Tubecast? Now I'm here with Block Thane. How you doing, man? What's up, guys? I'm doing just chilling, good. man. Just chilling. Yeah, just chilling, man. You good? Oh yeah, oh yeah. So um, this, so you're a so you're a streamer. So uh, what do you uh, what do you stream to? Uh, I stream to Twitch most of the time. Nice, don't huh? uh don't really do too much YouTube stuff. Nah, it's it's okay. It's uh, at teach teach your own now. So um yeah. So what type of stuff do you uh, like to uh, do on Twitch? Um, I mostly stream PUBG, but uh, I, I kind of do a half and half stream. I'll, I'll stream PUBG for about four or five hours a day, and then I'll switch over to Path of Exile typically. But I've been branching out a little bit more. I've been getting into some uh, some Fortnite and some other games. Oh, yeah. How do you like Fortnite? Because I have played that game. I haven't. I, I, I really enjoy it. I think the building aspect of the uh, whole game kind of throws a, a different loop into it, you know? Yeah, yeah, it's 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 something new because I like how they just you take on waves, but then you got crap stuff and so amount of time, and then you know, protect stuff. I'm not gonna ruin it, guys. Guys, look it up on YouTube, or if you look it up on something else, go get the Fortnite. Trust me. Okay. Yeah, so, definitely, it's definitely it's definitely worth it. So, uh, where, where, where are you gaming from? Just curious. Um, uh, I'm I'm currently gaming from uh, California, well, in the nice. United States, but uh, I'm from Idaho originally. Nice. Yeah. Yes. Yes. You're talking. You're, yes. I obviously everyone knows. Everyone knows in the audience. But yes, as you're talking, I yes, I, I hail from the great land of the north from A. <laughs> hey, hell yeah. <laughs> okay. Old Canadian, huh? Old Canadian. Old Canadian. I actually had someone. They're like, <laughs> Yeah, you're from Canada. I'm like, Yeah, I'm from. I'm can. I'm a Canadian. I'm a. I'm a, I'm, a, I'm a Canadianite. <laughs> Just <to> screw <laughs> that up. All right. So, um, when you first started gaming, like, what, like, wasn't there like one real game that really spoke to you, like, when it came down to gaming that really got you into gaming? Not streaming. I'm just saying gaming, like in general. Yeah, I started gaming when I was really young. You know, my family had a computer set up with the old dial-up internet that made the like beep boop beep boop beep boop beep when you connected or whatever it you did. Got mail. That really, yeah, that really annoying sound. Yeah. And uh, I started playing Diablo or Diablo, however you want to say Diablo, it. Yeah, uh, it's, it's good. Diablo. My dad, yeah, my dad played it and played it and played it. And he's like, no, there's too much gore. You can't play this game. And then I'd like wake up late at night and sneak on his computer and, and, and end up staying up like all night before on a school night just playing. That's exactly how I was when I was when I was uh, younger and it was came to N64 and when South Park, the uh, the original South Park game came out for the N64 and you throw piss snowballs and stuff like that. And my, my parents like, no, that's good. You're killing turkeys. I'm like, OK, <laughs> I'm like, OK, now Tepito, now I got yeah, I, I started. So Diablo was one of the big ones. And then um, actually it was 3.5 floppy at that time. And I was playing like my dad had Lemmings and Whoa. Doom and like some of those old school just like three and a half floppy games. Point three point zero. <laughs> yeah, man, I did. I played the old Wolfenstein's too, man. That's that's where I started. That's how. Oh yeah, because I'm looking at the new Wolfenstein. I'm like, I want to play that shit. But then I'm like, I I look. I remember like when people tell me about. It, they're like, yeah, Wolfenstein was like was like the first thing in Doom, man. I'm like. No way, what the fuck? And then I actually look it online, I'm like, oh, really? Snap, holy crap. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I'm like, wow, I can wow, I can actually go, this is the only game I can actually go go walking around and killing Nazis, okay. And I'm not and I'm yep. not part of the I'm not part of the Von Trapp family, okay. <laughs> right. After uh after that, it, it was a really I played those games for so long and then uh, I ended up moving into a game called Ashwin's Call, which was my first MMO, which not a lot of people have heard about. No, I haven't heard that. I haven't heard of that about one. Diablo, I have heard. Yeah. That one, I haven't. Ashran's Call came around about the time. Uh, oh, man, I can't remember the other big MMO that came around at that time. Runescape, just kidding. Yeah, it was. It was a little bit after Runescape, but okay. it yeah. was. It was very difficult. It was all about crafting. The combat was very difficult. And then maybe a couple years later, I got introduced to World of Warcraft, and that's where I really took off on gaming. Was just going nuts on World of Warcraft. I remember, I remember Warcraft when it was still like when you still it was all strategy based. Where it's not like it's not like the WoW MMO World of Warcraft. It's not that one. It was like the one before it. It was called Warcraft Three: Reign of Chaos or something like that. Yeah, yeah. I yep. and all Star Starcraft times and also Command and Conquer. <laughs> Those yep. were old school shit. Oh yeah, man. I, I played them all. I love. I, I still like. It's like, uh, what do you call that? Like uh, nostalgic or whatever. You go back and play those games, and you're like, oh man, I feel like I'm like a kid again. You know? Oh yeah, yeah. 
so I know, I know, I know as streamers, we make lots of mistakes. Trust me, I've made a lot of mistakes in, in this advocacy of this channel. Trust me, I've made a lot of mistakes even in streaming. I still am making mistakes and I gotta learn from shit. But I'll say that, do you have any words of advice for the audience? You know, if it, like something that you've learned that you've made a mistake about before, but then through experience streaming, like you've learned to, you know, yeah, I think uh, I think if you're gonna do it, um, take your time and do your research and really and take your time setting up your scenes. And if you're using OBS, really figure out how to get that iron out and be able to switch back and forth from scenes quickly and get your alerts set up so that they're working. You know, every time you don't have to mess with it too much. Because I spent hours and hours and hours and hours getting all that stuff set up. And 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 like like you said, still I have mistakes. I have glitches yeah. where like stuff not working. We all do. We all do. <laughs> like before, like I'll say this, just to, just to share with you guys. Like I know before, like you know how my intro, you know how my intro is. Like I was like, hey, hey guys, it's over here. Well, you know what? Before, like my mic would be when my, my mic would pop, the uh, all scratching and come out like that, and I'm like, it would all go, it would all fuzzy. And once I got this mixer, hey, it sounds pretty damn good. Yeah, <laughs> solved it. Solved all your problems. Yeah. So other other than that, my biggest my biggest uh advice for streaming is just be consistent like if you're gonna do it set a schedule set aside time if you really want to do it and yeah. stream every day if you can even if it's for a couple hours just make your presence known get out there on social media get your name out there yes yes social All media like places like places like twitter places like um twitch, huge twitch facebook i know some people use facebook but not, it's not that big on social i know it's big for social media but i'm like a lot of people they don't use necessarily for streaming purposes that are youtube but hey some people do you know uh snapchat the twitter instagram those are like three twitter's, big ones that twitter's people, huge twitter's huge yeah twitter's massive it just gets your name out to so many people yeah yeah it does it does so definitely uh, that's all the time we have for today but thank you for being on the show man holy Nice no worries, man. I oh. appreciate it. Yeah, it was great to have, great to be on here. Okay, guys. So you know what? That was Black Thane. His his channel will be in the comments below. To check him out, and please, guys, leave me a like because you know what? I like bacon. You like bacon. We all like bacon. Please, pizza, don't kill me. I like bacon. I like breakfast. It's, it's the best time of the day. Come on, breakfast is awesome. So please, guys, please. I got, I got, I got hand to you guys. Please leave me a comment because you know girls like guys get skills. Trust me, I need skills. Leave me a comment because I, if I can get better at a game, I need skills. Please, my girlfriend is telling me I need skills. Help me out. Please leave me a comment. And please, guys, subscribe if you want to, you know. But check those guys in the comments because they are awesome, too. So I'll see you guys next time, guys. See you guys. <laughs> Take it easy.